Well, here I am. Um, you know, like a big parking lot. There's a lot of stores and stuff. I got some pamphlets. Sam's going for a job interview, so I figured I'd lay pamphlets around or find somebody to give it to or something like that. I think I'm going to start making videos. I've been slow to make them because there's so many people fighting. And to be honest, a lot of the watchmen are half awake. I've been blessed with what I thought was a curse. In 2012, I lost my driver's license. And through the red tape and a lawyer's accident, I can't get them back without hiring another, another attorney. And I'm dealing with three states, so I'll never have my driver's license again. So I got stuck at home, and then I'm trying to get disability because I need two knee replacements. But anyway, what that gave me is it gave me a lot of time to study. A lot of time to track this stuff down. And to be honest, I'm at the point now where I don't even want to track down truth anymore. I already know too much. Because this is one of those things, once you find out the total truth, it ruins your life. Because you walk around and all the rest of these people are actors in a B movie. And I'm walking around and it's like I'm an extra from time to time because I have to go to town and deal with these people. And there's so much fighting in the comments on YouTube that I was dreading dealing with the comments because I don't delete comments. If someone comes in there and they're an idiot, I just leave it there. Somebody else will jump on them. And a lot of the stuff I've learned, people aren't gonna like. It's not about Jesus. I mean, that's easy. First Corinthians 15, one through four. I mean, that's the way to salvation. So, but when people learn some of the stuff that's actually going on, some of the stuff that they think is one thing, but it's actually another, there's a lot of this going on that I do think people need to know about. But anyway, got all the people. <laughs> Y'all see them, they're jumping around. I guess that's a gymnastics class or something. How you doing? Good, man. Just leaving pamphlets on the... <laughs> sure. Someone might read it. Find you Jesus today. <laughs> you betcha, that's all the only way to go. Yep, 1 Corinthians 15, 1 through 4. Yep. You have a good day, sir. You too. Have a blessed day. You as well. It's good when you meet people like that, you know, because so many people are aggressive about it. Which makes me know it's true. I mean, this is the most gentle religion out there, but yet it's the most hated. It, it makes no sense. When people get mad, they don't say, Muhammad, they say Jesus, because the name has power. They know it internally, they know it. They just don't know him. I mean, it's the only name you can't say in public without somebody getting pissed off. And that right there shows the power of it. I can say Muhammad all day. I can say Buddha all day. I might get this video taken down for saying Muhammad, but I've said it like 15 times. But, you know, what we're fixing to see is going to blow everybody's mind. And I think we're getting very close to it. What I'm gonna kinda of talk about, um, my buddy, David, he has a channel called um, Our Best Days Are Yet To Come. I think it's like that. But he's doing a video and talking about it too. But we're gonna see zombies, it's coming. Because when the dead raise, when Christ raises the dead, they're gonna to have to have an answer for it. They're gonna to have to have some kind of excuse. I mean, you're going to have people busting out of the ground. 
they're going to have to explain that to people. So I think they're going to do it through zombies. And I think we're going to see that before the rapture. Because we're right at the rapture. I mean, we're at peace and safety. And that's all we're waiting on. Peace and safety, then sudden destruction. Everything else has happened. We know that Israel's not going to destroy Iran because Iran is in the end times. They're in Armageddon. Still got Gog and Magog. So Iran's not going anywhere. And their military is a lot better than people give them credit for. I mean, I think they're rated 15th in the world. So they're not a pushover. But anyway, I'm going to start making some videos. It has been hard for me to get myself to make videos because I'm a person, I don't do selfies, I don't like pictures. I thought about just doing videos with pointing it at the wall or something but that's that's kind of boring to watch but I look like Grizzly Adams with his beard on here but anyway I'm gonna get to walking around here and see if I can find some people and I wanted to let everybody know what I'm planning and love peace and chicken grease and keep your eyes open because it's anytime <laughs>